Hey everybody, Mark Ignisi here in the back room at Norman's Rare Guitars. Welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. Dude, how about those Cleveland Cavaliers? We're getting back into, into playoff fever here. Oh my god. That's six straight. If you add on the, the three that they won to come back in uh, the championship series, that's nine straight playoff games. Oh, and Bron Bron surpassed <laughs> uh, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, number two most uh, all-time points in the playoffs, right behind Jordan. And he's still got he's still got some series left this year, and he's still got some years left in him, man. Pride of Akron, Ohio, right there, greatest of all times, in my humble opinion. Probably mm -hmm. everybody else will pretty much get on that same page within the next year or so here once he sets every single record. But hey, that's basketball. Back to guitars. It's Thursday. We were doing uh, we we're on a good run of thumping Thursdays, but. Uh, I started reading through comments. There is one guy, angered cheese, man. Every day, do a dean, do a dean. There's this other guy who really wants me to do an acoustic 12 string. <laughs> I don't have any worth doing, man. I swear to God, if Norm, Norm might buy something cool at the show. As soon as we get a cool acoustic 12 string, I will do it, I promise. But today, this one's for angered cheese. You know, we're gonna do this one for you, man. You can stop putting that comment on every single video. Come on back. This thing's from 1979. We have an original Dean Z in cherry finish. Oh yeah. We call it a Z. Well, we don't, they did, because yeah, like Zor, you know, it looks like a Z. It's basically a Gibson Explorer body. Uh, so let's talk about Dean's. Founded by Dean Zielinski, uh, about 1976, I think. Made some cool American-made guitars, man. Uh, you'll see him uh, in the hands of Billy Gibbons. You'll see him, uh, Elliot Easton, uh, Molly Hatchet. Yeah, a lot of those kind of late 70s bands uh, were playing it. But most famously, Dimebag Daryl kind of brought the company back to life. Uh, left for a little while to go to Washburn and then came back. Um, but they were a favorite of Dimes. And now you'll see a lot of the new metal guys. Dave Mustaine has switched over and uh, you know a lot of other guys have been playing these things again. Although I don't think Dean has any affiliation with the company anymore. I think he's off doing his own thing. But this is uh, you know one of their original late 70s ones. It's got a couple of issues which is why I haven't done it. But you know people ask. Look at the wear and tear though. That's pretty cool. Unfortunately at some point this thing had a small crack here on the heel. So you'll see, uh, that's no one did that to make it look cool. That's uh, That just happened when they uh, fixed the heel. Had a different strap button here at one time. Uh, and also somebody put Grovers on it. You can kind of see the outlines of uh, where the old tuners were. Pickup wise on these, I have no idea. Somebody out there is Dean expert. Hey, Angry Cheese, weigh in on this thing. I don't know, are those pickups right? They could be. I don't know. With a heel repair, I don't think anybody's really too concerned about the pickups but these are fun guitars man I don't want to trash talk Dean guitars especially these old ones they're killer instruments man they really do uh, they rip I'm excited to hear what this thing can do through a 410 hot rod DeVille are you mm. we won't do all EQs <laughs> at noon today I believe me the mood the, the mids will be uh, will be scooped in this mm. video why don't we go out there plug it in it's really I really want to focus on the clean sound of this guitar today let's go plug it in see what it can do all right, we're out front. We have the 1979 Dean Z, original cherry finish. What amp would be better to put it through than a 410 Hot Rod DeVille? <laughs> Facing Traveler at noon. Mids are off. We're scooping the mids today. Uh, let's start clean, because I know you all want to hear it clean. We'll switch back and forth between the clean and dirty. Let's see what this thing can do. <laughs>
Let's throw a little more drive on it again. Let's listen to the neck pickup uh, and the bridge pickup fully, uh, fully driven. <laughs> From 1979, it's original Dean Z, cherry red finish. Yeah, had a little work on the back there, had a heel repair. It's got changed tuners, but it's a great sound and great playing guitar, man. One of the early ones from Dean Zielinski and the guys over at the Dean Company. Angry Cheese, Angry Cheese, what was Angry? Angry, Angered. Angry, Angry Cheese, angered. that was for you, homie. Thanks for watching every day. That was for you. Hey, follow <laughs> me on Instagram, at Mark Agnesi. Follow the store at Norman's Rare Guitars. Check this and the rest of these guitars out online at normansrareguitars.com. We'll see you guys tomorrow for another episode of Guitar of the Day. It's Flat Top Friday. We'll see you then. Peace.